ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be doing tier lists. I am going to sit here and I'm going to tell you what the best stuff is and you guys don't get any input. And that's, that's how this is going to work. So anyway, this is the, okay, I guess it's already done. They're all in, I didn't even get to make it. One you did this five, five months, there's no way I already did a FNAF, <laughs> FNAF like character. That did I already did a, it already means that you've done it? Dude, am I, am I having an episode? <laughs> I totally just did it for a stream, said this sucked, and didn't turn it into a video. So we're gonna do it again, but this time it's gonna be a video. Uh, I'm gonna... Mango goes in F. I literally hate Mango. I love Blue Boy. Bloom Boy is an instant S tier. Uh, Bloom Girl is an instant F because he, she just sits under your desk and it's weird. Uh, Freddy from Final Fantasy Freddy's 2. I don't like this one. It's going in D tier. I hate Withered Bonnie. Withered Chica is actually kind of scary for real though, so she's B tier. Withered Foxy is just normal Foxy, but like modeled worse. Uh, we have Golden Freddy from Five Nights at Freddy's. Literally one of the scariest things of all time. That is an S tier. Uh, the puppet is very scary. That is an A tier. Springtrap, literally the purple guy, has to be an A tier. Uh, Freddy, classic. Top of S tier. Classic Freddy. Uh, I hate all the Phantom animatronics, they're all the worst. Five Nights at Freddy's 4, very scary, but not super scary. Uh, they keep me up at night. Classic Bonnie goes there. Uh, Nightmare Freddy, F tier, don't like Nightmare Freddy. Don't like Nightmare. Plus Trap is Baba, so he goes in A tier. The Jack Lantern versions suck, and Mangle, I also just hate Mangle. Let's talk about one of the best characters in gaming. I'm talking about Old Man Consequences from FNAF World. One of the best characters from one of the best games. That is top of S tier. That is quintessential Five Nights at Freddy's character right there. I have no idea what this is. That's F tier. Uh, classic Chica. Classic. This is the robot from Pizzeria Simulator who uh, likes to tell stories. This is where all the lore comes from. He's a C tier. Uh, I hate all the, uh, all like the circus baby animatronics, except for this guy, because he's, I know the guy who voices him, so he's cool. I think he also voices the Bonnie puppet. Shout out to Kellen. Uh, I hate Ennard. I hate whatever this is. I don't know what this even is. Uh, I hate these, because they're like little spiders and they're gross. I don't know what this is. Uh, it's Foxy, classic Foxy. Foxy goes on top of all the classic animatronics. This stream sucks. I'm sorry that it's making you feel stupid. Because I'm so much smarter than you. What happened? When did they just start pumping out like the most garbage tier character? But gar speaking of garbage, but garbage in the opposite sense. This is garbage if garbage was S tier. Uh, F, F, Mr. Hippo, obvious S tier. Uh, Ned Bear, obvious B tier. I'm gonna give Orville a C tier because he is friends with Mr. Hippo. Golden Freddy again, uh, extra scary this time. Here's like the toy animatronics or fun time animatronics or whatever. They're all F tier. I hate all of them. Music Man, on the other hand, classic Music Man, classic character. He's D tier. Uh, here's the uh, L Chip. I hate L Chip. Uh, I don't know who this is. Uh, here's like Spring Trap, but worse. So that's F tier. Here's Baby again, who's F tier. Uh, Lefty, who is a classic Five Nights at Freddy's staple character, wouldn't be Five Nights at Freddy's without Lefty, that's what they all say. And so he's there. And then F uh, S tier, also Phone Guy Classic. Everyone else is in F tier. Tell me that this is the same as my other tier list. Tell me this is not a direct improvement. I put Lefty in A tier because he reminds me of my favorite Twitch streamer, Hassan. So uh, you said America deserved 9 11. Did you mean that? Yeah. Look, I'm, this one is just more correct. It's more perfect. The The very top of S tier is almost identical. Now, why did I put Chica in D tier? I don't understand the thought process for the, for this. I'm going to be real. I, you know, we'll be back in a, in a year to do it again because I did this like a year ago, I guess. So this is on the front page. I just like opened a bunch of front page tier lists. Here's uh, every video game ever. I, I don't think I've played most of these. Here, I'll put one, we'll put Team Fortress 2 in Masterpiece, and then we'll leave it. Bioshock, haven't tried it. Castlevania, haven't tried it. Fallout New Vegas, haven't tried it. Half-Life, that's decent. I hate Smash Brothers. Actually, I'm just gonna put that in bad. I, I have not played any of these. Battlefield 1, dude, oh my gosh. Guys, remember when Battlefield 1 
was announced and they had the whole trailer with the seven nation army and it was like this looks like the coolest thing ever and it's a world war one first person shooter which was like unheard of until that point i was like this is gonna be freaking awesome and then i bought it it wasn't fun at all horrible horrible game that was really bad it wasn't horrible because it was almost good never played it never played it never played no 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 lego star wars 2 now let's talk about lego star wars 2 for the nintendo gamecube holy freaking epic was that a great game i remember playing on jabba's palace and there was pigmen and i was like that's funny dude i have not played like any v i played dark souls 3 i played dark souls 3 I got past the first boss, got stuck, and never played it again. That's a really bad game. I hated it. Mario Odyssey. Mario Odyssey is a very good game. Half-Life 2. I enjoyed Half-Life 2. Someone linked a furry husbando tier list. Are there, like, reoccurring characters in, in like, in furrydom? Make League its own category. Uh, it's just gonna it's just gonna be the only one in horrible. Uh, I really hate it. Actually, I'm gonna put Overwatch there too. I also hate Overwatch. Tetris, one of the best games ever made. Absolute masterpiece. Fortnite, one of the best games ever made. GTA 5. I have a lot of hours in GTA 5. It is a good game. I like the multiplayer, and by I like the multiplayer, I mean uh, I cheated a lot. Uh, Lego Indiana Jones. I hated Lego Indiana Jones. It is a good game. In retrospect, but when I would play it, I hated it. I was it's like it was like the Garfield show for me. It was just like I'm playing this, I have nothing better going on in my life. I always had a headache when I played that game, and I always had a headache when I watched the Garfield show. Uh Mario Kart 8! I love Mario Kart 8, just kidding, it sucks! It's like the worst Mario Kart ever made. I every time I stream it, number one, it kills my live stream. Number two, it kills my will to live because it's not fun. Anyway, Mario Galaxy is a... I would give it a great. I'd say Minecraft is a, a masterpiece because SMP Live was Minecraft and that was freaking epic. I don't like Overcooked. I don't enjoy Overcooked. CS Source? Dude, okay, let's talk about, let's talk about peak gaming. I hate Counter-Strike Global Offensive. CS Source though? Dude, so we installed it. We. we I was in the CAD class in high school, and we installed CS Source on all the computers, and we'd have 30-player LAN parties every day during lunch. And it was literally the best time ever. It was so sick. And then we uh, got uh, kicked out because a guy, uh, uh, he, he had his volume on the computer, and so at full blast, while the teacher was in the room, uh, it said, Bomb has been planted. Pac-Man masterpiece. Classic Pac-Man. Persona 5, never played it. Horrible. Pong, masterpiece. Peak gaming. I give it amazing, actually. Uh, Portal 2, I liked Portal 2 a lot. It's a very good game. Pac-Man's not even on the same level as Minecraft. Well, according to the tier list, it is. So, shut up. Portal? Portal is a, is a good game. I uh, never played... Well, no, I have played Jackbox. It's a bad game. That's the one with Among Us in it. That is a bad one, actually. Mario Brothers 2, classic. I love Mario Brothers 2. Mario Galaxy 2, like the same tier as Mario Galaxy 1, I guess. Terraria, I hate Terraria. I literally hate Terraria with every fiber of my being, but I can't put it on the same level as League of Legends. Terraria is boring. It's grinding. It's butthole, dude. It's farts. It's farting in my face. Every time I boot up Terraria on my computer, I instantly get the smell of fecal matter in my nostrils. It's actually disgusting. Never played Zelda... No, I have played Breath of Wild. It's okay, but it puts me to sleep. Is that Ocarina of Time? I hate Ocarina of Time. Ocarina of Time is boring. And have you seen the speedruns for Ocarina... Okay, you guys want to watch an... Let's watch an entire speedrun of Ocarina of Time right now. Hold on. The actual, like, speedrun part... After the cutscene and everything doesn't start until halfway through the video. And this is the run. Ready for the coolest speedrun you've seen in your entire life? Ready for something that's so freaking cool and visually appealing? He gets like the stupid sword, right? I don't even know. No, he gets rupees. He gets the sword and he gets rupees, right? He just walks around. It's literally just walk around, get a bunch of rupees, 
go to the store, right? Buy a thing. And you walk over the to the guy, you talk to the guy, he's like, oh yeah, no, now the speedrun's like finally gonna get started. After he's walked around and got memories. rupees for three minutes straight, it's two minutes of him walking around. Gets the camera stuck, and then he, he watch what happens. Right, he picks up an invisible rock! And then, and then, and then the coolest thing ever happens. The game ends. That's what happens. That's what happens. You walk around for five minutes, I did it. pick up rupees, no more, pick up a rock, and then the game ends. And that's the entire speed run. It's the worst. This game sucks. It's not fun to play casually. <laughs> it's definitely it's not wrong. fun to speed run, let alone there. watch. Never played any of the never played a video game before in my entire life. I liked Left 4 Dead. Left 4 Dead, very good game. I like Left 4 Dead. Getting over it, literally the word. I hate it. I hate getting over it. It's not funny. The guy who made it thinks he's super clever. Papers, Please is a decent game. Uh, Roblox. Okay, now we're getting to the real magic makers, okay? Top of Masterpiece. That is a Masterpiece video game. I remember my first time playing Roblox when I was nine years old. And we were playing Survive the Titanic, and it was freaking awesome. Rocket League is a good game. Beat Saber is a good game. Might I even say very good. I, I have played my fair share of Beat Saber. Wii Sports Classic. Absolute classic. Amazing game. Fallout 4. I, I played it up until the part where you have to go find Kellogg. I got the Kellogg's base. I got lost. I no clipped. And then it soft locked the entire game. And so, yeah, that game sucked. It was super boring. Uh, Gary's Mod. Classic. Love my MLP roleplay servers. That is an amazing game. Have you ever had sexual relations with another pony on the server? <laughs> yes, I have many times. Life is Strange. Never played it. Putting it in horrible. Life is Strange is True Colors. All I needed to understand that game was to uh, watch the trailer. It appeals to the worst kind of people who think that having empathy is a literal superpower. Who think that they're like, they got like main character sy syndrome because they're like, when someone else feels sad, I feel sad. Dude, shut up. Postal 2, I have played Postal 2. It's probably a bad game. I like referencing Postal 2. I like, I like going up to people and saying, Can you sign my petition? And I pee on them, but other than that, it's probably not a very good game. Battlefront 2, I got very mad. I broke my headphones over this game. It's probably okay. It's an okay game. Battlefront 2, but like the new one is good? It's a good game. Super Hot, I liked Super Hot. It also made me throw up, but that's, that's a good game. I put that, actually, I put that in very good. Super Hot's a very good game. Undertale, uh, it's an okay game. It's better than decent. It's an okay game because it's short. Deltarune's not short. Deltarune is all filler. And also, the Undertale soundtrack is infinitely better than Deltarune's. Deltarune's OST is hot trash. Uh, Pokemon Fire, Fire Red it was pretty cool. They had Missing No in it. Other than that, the game sucks. Animal Crossing uh, put me to sleep, but it got me, uh, it made me money on YouTube when it first came out. So that's a good game. Just Dance 2020, classic. Masterpiece of a video game. Uh, Fall Guys, classic masterpiece. No, I, you know, I'll put it in amazing, actually, because they still haven't added Mario to it. Uh, I played Microsoft Flight Sim. I did a stream. Then I, like, crash it into, like... I did, like, something that, that should have got me banned, right? That was a good game. That was funny. And you don't play games at all? I played these ones. What I... Okay, what you meant to say... Let me correct your statement real quick. What you meant to say is that uh, I don't play good. I mean, so, never mind. Super Liminal is the last one on here I played. That was, uh, that was a okay game. It was decent. It was a decent game. Okay, here's the tier list. Here's the official tier list of video games. These are the best video games ever. Why isn't Mario 64 on here? Who made this? Wait, I just realized they only have one Super Mario Brothers game on here, and it's Super Mario Brothers 2. There's no Mario Sunshine? Who made this tier list? But they have Crash Bandicoot Racing? What is it? Neptunia? Didn't like Chris Chan do something with that or something? That's on here. Chris Chan made this tier list. Anyway, whatever. <laughs> do furry husbando tier list. I will after I do soda. 
This is so I can clickbait the video. This is what it's all about. I'm not going to be able to clickbait it with the Fursona one. I hate 7-Up. Well, I don't hate it, but I don't like 7-Up. Diet A&W, they're the least bad diet soda. I hate A&W root beer. A&W root beer is the, is the, it's garbage. Barks, on the other hand, let's talk about the perfect drink. Love Barks. Bangs. Dude, are you stupid? Are you stupid? Do you not know cursive? Are you dumb? Right, I'm about to learn you a thing. When you're doing cursive, right, a G, it's like that, but like, not, it's like big. It's like, it's like that. It's like something like that, right? And then, and then a Q, it's literally the same thing. Okay, no, hold on. What am I? I okay, I don't. It doesn't look like that. It doesn't look like that. It's barks. It's barks, and they're they're literally their catchphrase is "It's good." Canada Dry never had all their variety of flavors. Like their ginger ale, though, really killed it. That's the one product of Canada I'll ever consume in my entire life. Coca Cola caffeine free. Why? That's the only option. No, I don't want caff. No F. Cherry Coke, classic, classic beverage. That's actually an S tier beverage. And normal Coke's like B tier, but Coca-Cola Vanilla, pretty good. That's a, that's a good drink right there. Uh, Coke Zero, I'll drink it. Uh, some weird, funky looking Diet Cokes, Cherry Diet Coke, probably going to be in the same tier as Coke. No, it's going to be above Coke Zero, are you kidding me? Diet Coke, definitely above Coke Zero. Uh, they're kind of like the same thing. Dr. Pepper though, oh my god. Nectar of the gods. But then you got, oh that was Diet Cherry Dr. Pepper. Okay, no, that sucks. It leaves like a filmy taste in your mouth. It's it's like it's like what did you put in this? Spider webs? Like what is this? But normal Dr. Pepper? Boing. I don't I I've I've had Mountain Dew. I hate Mountain Dew. Alright. Diet mug, terrible. Mug proper is the second best root beer. I'm actually gonna put it at the bottom of S. Cherry Pepsi, it's it's good. I'd probably have it over a normal Coke. Uh, Diet Pepsi sucks. Normal Pepsi is de is like the definition of a C tier beverage. Another Pepsi, but with real sugar. What do you mean real sugar? What does normal Pepsi have in it? Am I freaking out? Like, is there, what do they put in fake sugar? P. Let's talk about a disgusting name for a disgusting beverage. Squirt. So this is what Squirt is. Squirt is like squeezing a lemon into your mouth and calling it soda. It's bitter. It's not fun. It has a consistency to it. I, it's gross. And I've never had any of these other ones. Okay, this is the official soda tier list. These are all the, the good sodas and everything else here I've never had. Uh, and that automatically means it's bad because if it was if, if these sodas were so good, why haven't I had it already? It's time for the one people have been asking for. I'm so scared. Brian Griffin is on there. Okay, I have no idea who this is, but this guy's basically this guy has this guy has nipples. That is an instant uh, go to hell. <laughs> Am I ranking these as in as in I would I would perform adult actions with them? Because in, in that case, because I, I looked at I looked at I, I saw this I saw eh maybe, and I'm like what is this what is this a maybe two? Okay, I got it. I got it. I'll fix it. So you might think, right? I'm just sitting here and I'm putting them all in G tier. Why is it G tier? But no. If you, have you guys seen Shadow the Hedgehog gameplay? I'm like the president in that game. I have a framed picture of Shadow the Hedgehog on my desk that I, I stroke when I, when I remember the good old days. That's me. He also has a gun, which is super cool. Uh, Sonic. Uh, you. But he's above go to hell. Foxy from Bones and Freddy's? Okay, you make me happy. Um, let's see here. Alex, Alex the Lion. He's a cutie. We got King Julian, absolute hero. Okay. That's the easiest. That, that easy, just absolutely the easiest one. The easiest one. Yogi Bear? Okay. Boing. Oh, Yogi Bear goes up there. Springtrap? Dude, okay, Springtrap also goes up there. You 
make me happy. The penguins of Madagascar do make me happy. We're putting all the penguins up in, in this one because they, they... Nothing makes me happier than the penguins of Madagascar, that's for sure. Pretty fast bear go. And cute. Okay, there we go. Official tier list. Oh, my, Brian, my beloved. Brick tier list. Okay, this is going to be... This is the one that's going to define a generation. These are all terrible. I like this one. And this one. That's A tier. That one's B tier. That one's probably C tier. That one's also C tier. These two are F. Okay. Brick tier list done. Brick tier list speed run complete. World record. <laughs>